It's Ash from Super Videos, back for another one. We're gonna talk about The Walking Dead's season 10 finale, season 10 episode 16, which is called A Certain Doom. We're gonna take a look at some photos that they just released for the season 10 finale. AMC and The Walking Dead's Twitter page actually released tons of photos for not only The Walking Dead, but also Fear The Walking Dead and World Beyond as well. I will be doing videos on those separately, but in this one, we're just gonna look at and talk about the season 10 finale photos that they released for The Walking Dead. With that said, let's dive right into it. So the first picture that they released is this badass shot of Beta. Now this is of course, when Beta is in the middle of the herd, he's gathering the herd that's gonna be attacking the tower that the survivors are staying at. Then we have this picture of Daryl in the middle of the herd. Now, they did release like a poster a while back. This was the poster. It was colored a little differently, but this was the poster. Now I think this and the previous picture go back to back, like they're related because they're both in the middle of the herd. One has Beta in it, the other has Daryl in it. Then we have this pretty awesome shot of the survivors putting guts on themselves. Now we do know that the survivors are gonna be using the guts trick just like they did during No Way Out to blend in with the herd. Now this time, some of them are actually going to be wearing the Whispers masks as well to blend in. So on top of covering themselves with guts and blood to blend in with the walkers, they're gonna wear whisper masks to blend in with the walkers and the whispers. So in this particular shot, we have Kelly, who's actually holding a whisper mask. We saw her putting it on in the trailer. We have Judith there, we have Carol there. She's looking badass as always. She has like a knife in hand as well. She's looking pretty badass and intimidating in this picture. We have other people there as well. We don't see their faces, but I'm sure Daryl and others are gonna be amongst them. We have a walker in the middle of the floor with its guts pulled out. Now, obviously they're pulling the guts out of this walker and covering themselves with it. That's why the bucket is there that we see right next to the walker as well, but there's really nothing else to say. This is inside the tower and it does connect to multiple shots that we have in the trailer of the survivors covered in blood heading out the door to walk into the herd. Then we have this pretty interesting picture of Daryl and Negan. Now I sense a lot of intensity in this picture. I don't know if it's just the sense I'm getting, but I feel like this is gonna be a pretty intense scene. Now, of course, Negan and Daryl have some history between them. They're in good terms, but there's some bad blood between them, which makes sense. But it's gonna be interesting to see what we see with these two characters and how they're gonna work together to get out of this situation. I feel like for both of them and for everybody else to survive and for them to make sure that everyone is safe, they're gonna need to work together. So it's gonna be extremely interesting to see how they do that and whether they're able to put their egos aside. Because let's be honest, Negan has a lot of ego, Daryl has a lot of ego, but for them to actually be able to pull through and make sure everyone's safe, they're gonna need to put those egos aside and they're gonna need to put their differences and their past history aside. So it's gonna be interesting to see how they actually do that. Then we have this picture of Eugene and his crew. So Eugene, Princess, Yumiko and Ezekiel. They're near this train junkyard and this is most likely where or around the area where they meet Stephanie. Stephanie being the girl that Eugene was communicating with on the radio. Now, I don't know if we're gonna see Stephanie in this episode. We might, I hope we do. But what we know for sure is that this picture is connected to that storyline from the comics. In fact, in the comic book, there is a train junkyard as part of the story in the future. So this could be like an Easter egg or foreshadowing for that story that's gonna be coming up later that involves Eugene and Stephanie. And that's pretty much all the pictures that they released. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm super excited for the finale. It's been a long time coming. I mean, it's time for them to come back. It's time for The Walking Dead to come back. I am extremely excited and happy that the finale is gonna be coming up in the next few months. And I'm super stoked and excited and hyped after watching all of these pictures for the finale. But with that said, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to press the like button. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe to join our community and make sure to press the bell button to receive notifications about daily uploads. That's it for this video. See you next time for another super video.